Hey, how's it going everyone? Saints fan back again with another GTA Online video and today I'll be talking about Ron's contact missions and the reason is because this week there is double GTA money and RP on all of Ron's contact missions. So if you've been looking for a way to make money very easily and in a fun manner, then this will be something you want to look into. Now, in addition to the Ron's contact missions, if you're also looking for a fun and easy way to make money, the new adversary mode stockpile is double GTA money. You can play that with some friends and make, you know, $100,000, dollars if your game goes long enough. But if you want something that is a little bit more laid back, not against other players, something that is fairly easy because the NPCs in these missions aren't that great at all, then Ron's contact missions are, are pretty good. Now, Ron's contact missions aren't the best missions in the game. Like, Martin's missions are better. I think Trevor's missions are a little bit better. But, for some reason, Rockstar decided to make Ron's contact missions double GTA money. And what I'm going to do, in the description, there will be three playlist links. One for the Xbox One, one for the PS4, and one for the PC. And what these playlist links are, are all of Ron's contact missions in a playlist so you don't need to search for them and you can just play them over and over again so if you want go in the description click on whatever link you need and then add it to your game now i believe the pc playlist actually has like one or two missions not in it so if you're wondering maybe why not all of them are there that's just how the playlist came but you can make your own playlist if you really want to now some tips some tricks regarding these missions i can give you guys one, I would say, because it actually happened to me, don't get too cocky, especially if you're playing these missions on hard, which you are which you should be doing because you get more money for it. Don't think you're unstoppable, even with armor, even with NPCs not being that great. Some of these missions are kind of difficult. Like one, I think it's the base invader mission. You have to go into the military base and there are a ton of freaking military and you will get wrecked. I got wrecked and... We ended up failing the mission. And one thing I will say, if you're doing the playlist method and you fail a mission, you can't repeat it. So if you fail a mission, you're just not going to get money for that mission. So just know that going into it, you know, sort of dial it back a little bit. Take your time. You can use some of the new aircraft or even use your oppressor if you want. You can use the old school buzzard if you want. But don't be expecting you to just walk in there and and take everyone out on some of these missions some of them are super easy and you can do that but for the base invaders one especially just know it is pretty difficult now two missions that you can play solo that are super easy romance isn't dead and fueling the flames these two missions are probably the easiest ron missions and if you are just playing this stuff solo these are the two i would recommend playing if you take your time doing it all you can get around 37 to 40 thousand dollars per mission but know that the quicker you play these missions and complete these missions the less money you're going to get that's the way the missions work the longer you're in the mission the more money you will get also if you're looking for ways to make some extra rp in addition to the money switching to free aim will actually give you a little rp boost as well as using the playlist and completing the playlist that gives you an rp boost too so if you're wanting to level up then those two are great ways to bump up your level now if you were wondering how much you could actually make with these missions and with these playlists someone actually went through and he said it took him about 33 minutes to complete the playlist which isn't that long at all so that tells you just how quick you can do these missions and he said he got around a hundred thousand dollars total with about twenty one thousand rp so just per hour, that's around 200,000 per hour with around 40,000 RP per hour. And specifically the missions, Wet Workers, he got 25,000 with 5,000 RP. Fueling the Flames, he only got 14,000 with 3,000 RP because that one goes super quick. Turbine Carbine, he got $20,000 with 3,700 RP. Romance Isn't Dead, he got only $9,000 with 2,000 RP. But again, that's because you can do it super, super quick. Crank up the volume. That's another one you can do super quick. He got 10,000 for it with 2,300 RP. And then Base Invaders, he got 23,000 with 4,500 RP. But again, if you take longer to do these missions, then you get more money. So it just depends on if you want to quickly go through them and get less money, but you have more time to do more missions, 
or if you want to take your time, get more money, but you won't have as much time to do more missions. Anyway, that is it. Just wanted to make this quick video to let you guys know about the Ron contact missions because I figured if you guys want to take advantage of this opportunity to make some money, this is a super easy and pretty fun way because if you think about it, at least for me, I don't play missions that often, so it's kind of a nice change of pace from all the free roam activities and businesses to just go into a, a private lobby with some of my friends and just play missions and not have AI that are super crazy overpowered and can snipe you from across the map, you know? And it's actually kind of cool to use some of the new features like the thermal vision in one of the missions. I use thermal vision because it was super dark and that was really cool. It was just, I don't know, it brought something new and different to the table that I haven't really experienced in quite some time. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Now, in addition to all that, I'm doing a shark card giveaway that I'm picking the winner on Friday. So if you guys want a chance to win $3.5 million, then go follow me on Twitter and retweet the giveaway. Thank you all for watching though. Please drop the video like if you did enjoy. Subscribe for more awesome GTA content. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one.